Don't move one step closer, not one step. I'll show him. You don't need to keep saying. Okay, I need to, I need to calm down. Where well, is he going to be all right? Well, you shot him. What do you think? Um, I need you. I need you to put the gun down. I need you to put the gun down. Carefully. Well, shouldn't we call an ambulance? Why, and tell them what exactly? That it was an accident. Please, you can't let him die. Such a mess. OK, honey, I need you to listen and do exactly what I say. Do you understand? Yeah, I need to hear you say it. Yes. OK, I need you to go in the kitchen and um, find the cloths and the, the, the washing up gloves and the bin liners. Why? And then when you've done that, I need you to go upstairs and get changed and then put your clothes in the bin bag and bring it back downstairs. And do it now, please, because we haven't got much time, so hurry. Yes, I need an ambulance, please. That's good. Good boy. Now, I need you to be quick. The ambulance is on its way. Is he going to die? I don't know. But whatever happens, I need you to be brave now. I'm scared. Well, it'll be OK. You just have to do what I tell you. So I, I need you to put the gloves on and wipe the gun clean. And my fingerprint. And then I need you to go to the safe. Take out my jewellery, um, money, anything in there of value. In fact, you can start with that vase up there. I don't understand. I want you to put it in the bag with the gun. I want you to take it all out to the woods and hide it somewhere the police won't find it. No. No, I'll, I'll tell them it was an accident when the ambulance gets here. You won't, Lachlan. See, I, I believe you, but they might not. And, and even if they do, I just... This is why we have to make it look like a break-in gone wrong. I can't let you do that. Go to the B&B and get showered and wait for me to call you, OK? Do you understand? I just wanted him to be my granddad again. Do you understand? He's still breathing, but he's lost a lot of blood. Let him know we'll need a full standby team. We found the safe wide open. Empty. So you think it might have been a burglary then? It's a possibility. We're still checking the house and the grounds. Chrissy, what's happened? Um, it's my dad. They're, they're saying he's been shot. Shot? Are you OK? Yeah, I need to go. I need to be with him. The doctor has some news. Um, this is my son. I see. Well, as I was saying, your father's lost a lot of blood. But you can deal with that, right? A pellet of shot has caused a small but not insignificant rupture to the abdominal aorta. How, how serious? He's been taken in for surgery as we speak. They'll do everything they can. But... I'm afraid that's all I can tell you right now. I'm sorry. He's not going to make it, is he? He'll be fine. You don't know that. I heard what she said. Oh, she doesn't know your granddad like I know your granddad. Listen, everything is going to be OK. I can't deal with him right now. What? You had another argument? Will you just get rid of him, please? Sorry, now's not a good time. So you did do everything that I asked? Exactly like you said. Good boy. There's no going back, is there? I mean, what if there's something we didn't think of? As or... long as we stick to our story, we'll be fine. Look, it's just you and me now, OK? Come here. We don't need anybody else. <laughs> 